welcome back to Control. I'm sorry that the last episode ended so suddenly, but something unexpected happened. Uh, I ran out of the disks, disk space, so yeah. Luckily, we don't have to deal with those guys again. No, no, no. I do not think we will be that. We have to be that lucky. There doesn't seem to be anything in here either. Seem to be anything over here. Okay, I can hear the hiss. seem to be empty, so... I think might be somewhere upstairs. Oh, the cameras, maybe? Wait, what's that? Okay, just a picture. Keep the ritual. What ritual? This is the only cubicle that looks different. Okay, I don't see anything here. Of course, we are not equipped flashlight. Maybe somewhere up there. Of course. some notes as well. Okay. Check this place. No, I just wanted to do the book. I don't know. Especially since we can hear something. Something here, it, as if it's on the other side of the wall. Oh, sorry. I think it's over up there. Yep. Okay. I know. Uh, I will check that. <laughs> Someone call a plumber. Whoa, 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 don't do that. Okay. Dear House of Representatives, my husband, Francis, read an article before he died about how the universe was really just a computer program. He believed it. I thought it sounded silly, but now I think he was right. Francis was hit by a car a few months ago, a drunk driver. I don't think it was supposed to happen. My neighbor's son, Jeremy, broke one of our windows with a football a week before Francis died. Francis yelled at Jeremy for it. He was a bit harsh. This is important because I see Jeremy on his computer through their living room window. He's on it all the time. His mother says he's a computer whiz. I think Jeremy is operating the computer program and he changed the universe so that the driver would hit Francis. He did it to get back at Francis and for yelling at him. Is there a way to change the computer and make Francis come back? I have some money if it's expensive. I don't know how these things work. I don't care if Jeremy gets in trouble or not, I just want Francis to come home. Francis and I were very happy together. I can feel him not being here and I know it's not right. Oh, I guess that's 
I guess this is what I was hearing. Okay, this one's pretty normal though. Nothing else? Great, yay! Oh. No! We're not doing any alerts. Mainly because we don't have any control point. Well, maybe the, maybe this will work. Yeah, it works fast. Fine. Never mind that. That evaluation hole. Can't get through here. I'm trying. Yeah. First things. Okay. Open somewhere over there since Polaris is very stubborn loaded. Thank you. Get the shoulder. Which is broken. Okay, and we can get through here. Yes, nope, we definitely cannot get through. I thought about that. Enough clearance for this, please. Oh, thank you. And this. recordings of the audio phenomena were uploaded onto the internet shortly after the event. These recor records circulated rapidly on popular message boards. The communications department utilized this exposure by creating sky trumpet hawks. Videos on and posting re and posting related th theories to spread confusion and draw attention away from the event's paranormal origin. Industrial noise, particularly the sound of metal drilling, was found to be widely accepted explanation. Theories about the sounds emanating from the earth itself, known as seismic hum, uh, emerged from the public itself and were encouraged by the Bureau to generate further misdirection and eventual public uh, this, uh, this, this interest. Witnesses of the event were monitored discreetly afterwards. Observed symptoms were consistent with blank deprivation, but subsided after 12-15 days. The length of the symptoms directly correlated to the individual's proximity and sheltered to the supposed epicenter. One linked, although accidental, casualty can be listed. See report 3, the effects of planar friction and hearing aid. Okay. Mm, over here. Oh, can listen. You're listening to America Overnight, a beacon in the darkest recesses of possibility for more than 29 years. We have another letter from a listener. This one's unsigned, but postmarked from Toledo. It says, Dear America Overnight, I have the most wonderful appliance for your listeners. It is a miracle of God. A fondue set. A fountain. A blessed gift. Blessed is spelled with a capital B. Hmm. Go on, they write. Dive on in. It is molten hot. Perfect for meat. No signature. As far as I know, no fondue set was sent to us here at the studio. Just this letter. Wait. I think there's something else in the envelope. Some kind of black powder. With white shards in it? Bone, maybe? Karen? What is this? Karen? We're on the air, Karen. Where are you? What? Why is this powder in the booth? Is this... is this ash? Oh. Oh, God. Karen? How do I cut to commercial? Oh, okay.
Well, I guess this is like previous to what we heard in the upper parts of the house. Okay, what do we have here? Gibbs reporting in. It has been eight days since the collapse and still no sign of any rescue efforts. The Bureau is either completely unaware of our situation or are inca incapable of helping us. Or maybe it's intentional. How many times have we seen the Bureau not give two shits about its own hardworking staff when they go missing in this place? How many times do we let it slide? Oh, at least it wasn't me. Too many. I'm ashamed to admit. Anyway, there have been some developments. Strange crystals have begun growing through the walls. They seem to block some corridors, but not others. The path to the caves is always left open, but we're not sure why. Luckily, the crystals keep out the astral spike. One's been hounding us for days. John, Nikolai and Sarah went to try and find a radio, but never came back. We think the spike got them. I think it's haunting us. Dog says spikes only exist in the astral plane, so what the f is going is it doing here? If we get out of here, I'm hiring a lawyer. This uh, these are unsuitable working conditions. Hell oh, yeah. Do you not know what's on the other side? Some must have in transfer bay. Access is prohibited per safety regulation 18.8. Hmm. Okay, so we have to go through here. Yeah, we are not able to get through. Because we are not leaving our altered item. Much. And so and that's general. the altered item. Looks pretty secure. Not really. But it does. It's so dark. <laughs> and I have full I should hire someone who builds smaller yeah. machines. Yeah, I should. Okay. We need three batteries. Which I don't see anywhere. Power course. Here we go. It's really it was supposed to be. They are over there. There's something got Transport? No, 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 do not transport it anywhere. Maybe you want me. I just wanted to make sure this is closed. I guess we can now go down. And here. Yep, 
able to open this up. No altered material yep. detected in area. Personnel may now safely enter. Good. Have a bureau full day. Okay. Nope, no, 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 you don't. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I don't even know what killed me. I just saw some red and then death. Okay, we are back here. I guess we can just go through. Yep, both doors are open. Just die. Really? I missed. I really like this weapon. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I hate those guys. Doesn't seem that we are done. Now we are done. Okay. Oh, uh, I really can't see a thing. Can I take that fight with me? Wait, is it? Is there any working light? Or mm, maybe nope, that's it. <laughs> that's too closed. I think this is closed. Oh god damn it, I can't see a thing. No, this is closed. This is yep, this is definitely closed. Then why am I supposed to get down here? I need some light. Really? Unless... I'm glad that does nothing, really. You. I need to look for some... Dark way through. Let me see it. Yep, that's definitely closed. Come on. There's nothing over here. Maybe we're supposed to get up there. Oh really? Thank you. So yeah, this seems... I'm fairly sure it was intentional. My... my... He destroyed me. I don't think I can use that. Thank you. Why is it so dark? I've been through the Alan Wake part. Oh, 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 it's properly weird. trained. Eh. Guess I pass. I Guess am very I don't. properly trained. I'm not. We are going up. Okay. I remember that camera. How the hell did it get out? 
Are they his shitty movies now? Do you really want to know? That's funky. Oh no. Okay. Really? Really, someone. Ah. Okay, that's just level two, so... Okay, the soundtrack is all foamed. <laughs> oh, look me! Okay. Nope, that doesn't work. Well, kinda works. Okay, I may I maintain the speed of okay. Unless I can destroy those. Okay, I think we are slowing down whenever we hit something. I saw you. I still see you. Oh. Oh, we're not done. Okay. There's eternal darkness behind us. Maybe we can just jump this. Oh, he's level 10. Okay, never mind. This one's still alive. Wait, what? I saw this. I saw a outline. Oh no, you don't. Oh, how much do you have? Cool. Oh. Third act villain, okay. How many eggs do we have? Okay, take number two. I see you over there. Ooh. 
Wait, we were on a different track. Oh well. This time. Wait, what? Oh. We're back? Oh. Did that really just happen? It felt like a dream. Or maybe a bad movie. Hey, it was also. <laughs> Really don't okay. He didn't have a map from second there no. What the hell is going on? I don't know. Yeah, no thank you, no. Ooh. Oh no, it's personal mode. Yeah. I'm not willing to go all the way. But there. Seems to me because it's too damn dark. Now, where were we supposed to go? Um, oh, we were down here, so... Uh, here. Yeah, pretty much. Um, okay, the first bathroom. Never mind. Okay, he threw something at me, I think. Oh no, it's the one shooting, so yeah. Oh well. <sighs> okay, you know what? Actually, I think a fairly good place to end this part. Oh, I forgot about this. Well, I'm not using. Can we see the slump? I'm not really using... Yeah, I just got a call from my dad and I don't remember what I was talking about. So, yeah, this is a very, very good place to end this part. So, thank you very much for the live and see you soon. Bye!